Hello my dear comrades, welcome to the test polygon in uh, Moscow region where the soil is quite difficult and today we're going to be testing uh, some amount of the metal detectors including uh, classic quasar arm units, uh, the new quasar F3 unit and the traditional uh, Deus with the classic coil. So, a little bit about our polygon. Uh, and first of all, this is going to be quite a short demo. Uh, I'm not going to test anything that I got with me, but uh, I'm going to concentrate on the main task of comparing these two detectors. So, this is a new Quasar F3, and uh, of course we all know the Deus. And uh, so, okay, what about our test polygon? Uh, so. so, about our test polygon. Uh, the soil is difficult, so this is one of the most difficult soils I ever met, and uh, maybe, maybe not the most difficult in the world, but in my experiences this is quite difficult. Uh, Quasar shows that this is 3 degree of, uh, of ground balance, and Deus tunes approximately 86. So let me know what you think, think about this uh, about this ground. So test polygon. Uh, the first, the shallow target will be at around 20, 20 to 21 centimeters. Second one will be around 25 centimeters. The next one will be around 30. And I have another hole which is 35, but we don't we will not need it for at least one of these devices. Okay, so let's get to the tests about our test targets. So, first of all, we have a modern five rubles. This is the copper, co uh, copper coin of around 24 centimeter. I will double check this size. Uh, this one is classical coin uh, called uh, the gold of the party the gold of the communist party because normally when you dig it out you're happy that it's it's looking like a gold but it's not gold unfortunately this is the coin from 40 something from 90 foot 19 40. Uh, the next one will be classic uh, Russian uh, Soviet Kopec, one Kopec, which is very small. I, I don't think I will double check the size, but I think it's around 10 uh, millimeters and it is quite thin. It's very, it's very small. It's actually one of the smallest uh, coins in the world, maybe. I don't know. <laughs> okay, and the final one will be uh, the coil, the uh, the coin which we call here like a fish skin so the, like a small piece of the fish skin these are uh, the small coins uh, they are very thin they are made from the from the silver wire so they cut silver wire and they pressed this silver wire in the, into these coins and normally the age of this coin is around 500 years Okay, this is silver, very small, very difficult target. So, let's run the tests. So, the first target will be the gold of the Communist Party, uh, which we put which we put at, at um, 25 centimeters uh, for Quasar. It's not a hard target. So, okay, Quasar is, uh, have a coil of 12 kilohertz and the ground balance is tuned. I think I better turn it out, turn it off. And of course the menu could be in English, but today it's in Russian. Okay, the filter is normal, so it's like a um, reactivity of maybe two uh, in Deus. The size of the coil is 21 per 27 centimeters. Uh, and this is the classic coil, so I think the size is quite quite similar this is a little bit better a little bit bigger okay so the first target 25 centimeters the sound is not ideal it's not ideal but in this ground it's it's difficult to find ideal sounds but it is it is uh, coin sound
We can move to, just for example, we can move to fast or very fast filter, which is normally used for a very difficult grounds or for, for very difficult places like uh, garbage places, maybe old Roman sites, uh, garbage with the iron. So very fast, it's it's super garbage place. We still hear it, but not very good. Okay, let's go to the next depth, which which is which is uh, thirty centimeters. Oh, I'm surprised that we 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 hear it almost. We almost hear it in the very fast filter. So even on the garbage place, we can dig the coins on thirty centimeters. Let's try fast. Very good signal. And not perfect. It's definitely not perfect, but it's the signal you will stop and dig. So I have an idea to put it in 35 centimeters. No signal or almost no signal. Okay, let's go to the depth filter. Normal slow. Let's try slow. I will. I, I'm not sure w whether I will dig this signal or not. Probably on the very good place I will dig it. And let me show uh, without target. So that was the signal for the target. Okay, so that's uh, that's about it with the quasar. N or no, no. Let's take another uh, another coin, which will be a little bit more difficult. A smaller, a little bit smaller copper copper coil. The depth is uh, twenty five centimeters. The sound becomes difficult. Let's move to the fast. Not really good. Not. Uh, let's move to the normal. Not an easy target, but we can we can have it in twenty five. I don't, I don't think this is a limit, but I think around twenty seven to twenty eight it will be the limit. Okay, and now let's take the smaller coins which is one copic. One copic on 20 centimeters. The sound is bad. When I go out from the ground, it becomes a little bit better. Okay, if I, I'm on the normal, let's go to the slow. The signal is more strong. Let's go to the fast or very fast. The signal is very good, but already quite uh, not very good, not very strong. Let's move to the 25 centimeters with this one Copic. Very fast, doesn't see. Let's take normal. Almost nothing. Not completely nothing, but almost nothing. Okay, let, let's try slow. The sound is not really good. You will not dig it on the regular place, probably. On the good place, yes, this is the target. I almost forgot about the last coin. Uh, unfortunately, I don't have it on the stick. 
so it will not be very deep okay 20 centimeters which is actually normally the the probably the best depth you can get this coin I think I was a little bit too optimistic about this coin. <laughs> on 20 centimeters, on this kind of the ground, you will not find it. I can see, I can hear something, but but this is nothing. Let's try very slow. This is nothing actually. I don't know how to read this sound, how to interpret. Is this the coin or is this just nothing? I think this is close to nothing. I think we will make a 15 centimeters hole now. I took from the 20 centimeters and I put it around 15. It's out. Not much problem. It takes it very good. Filter fast. Still have it. Okay. Okay, let's move on. Let's move on. Let's move on. <laughs> To the Deos, we are starting with the same coin, uh, with the same small coin on the 15 centimeters. On this ground, Deos becomes wild. So discrimination. We will have a polyphony, so we don't have a discrimination. So we have polyphony. The sensitivity 90. The frequency is 12 iron let's increase but i don't think this is this is affecting the polyphony the speed is first one and so on i don't think this is very important the ground is 86 okay let's try it the small silver on the 15 I don't think we have it. I don't think we got it. Okay. Let's take it out and let's take a classics. So the classic gold of the party. Oh, sorry. Not a bad signal. It's on the on 20, 20 centimeters. Yellow coil coin. Good signal. Okay, twenty five. It's it's all folks. It's it. It's 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 unit, sorry. This is unit. And this is nothing. And uh, what's happening on the screen? What's what's that's interesting. Uh, what's happening on the screen? We see that there is a huge signal of something. 
but this something get cuts. I think this is the very huge signal from the soil and it got cuts uh, from the from the good signal. Okay, so there is no way we can test further depths with this. So 25 centimeters was not achievable. Let's take the copper. Let's put it 25. Nothing. This is a little bit more difficult target. 20 centimeters. We have it on 20. Okay, and finally, let's move to the one copic. One copic on 20. We have something, but it's almost dead on 20. Then I suppose 25 will be unreachable. Yeah, that's it. Okay, so that was, I think, quite a nice comparison between the uh, units of the different pricing. And uh, I think the main problem with DEOS is that uh, it is the like high gain uh, equipment, which normally shows the good results in the air, very good results in the air, quite good results in the sand, but very bad results in our hard grounds. Okay, that's all folks. Thank you for attention. And also, if you want more extended test, uh, there will be a test in Russian. I, I think I will do English subtitles, uh, so you will be able to have a look at the complete tests, because I'm going to compare not only Deos, I'm going to compare different firmwares of the Quasar units and also I'm going to compare the new one and the old one. I don't expect a very dramatical improvements with the new one, uh, but uh, we will see, we will see. The sound should be better. Okay, thank you for your attention and um, in one week I will be here again and you can give me some advices how should I uh, perform the settings of the DEOS to be able to use it in such a difficult grounds. Thank you, bye bye.